Yes, yes sir. All right. from the executive session at 12.45 p.m. Um, we've got a few items that were um, reviewed during the executive session. We have one permit that went through a process that after review uh, we didn't feel comfortable with, um, so we wanted to take it um, back to where the attorneys advised us to, as to how we should review uh, permits during our current architectural pause. Um, that was a permit for um, a Unit 27 um, Block J residence uh, that has been paid for. Um, and do we have a motion uh, on this document? I make a motion to approve it. Second. Second. All right. All in favor? Yes. Uh, there were then uh, two other uh, properties that were brought to us. Um, the first one uh, was in Unit 35. Um, do we have a motion on this document? Motion to approve the Unit 35 discussion. Second. All in favor? Right. Passes unanimously. The last um, document was from Unit 12. Uh, do we have a motion on this? Do we have a motion on the Unit 12 property? To approve? Yes. Uh, make a motion to approve. Second. All in favor? Motion passes unanimously. Document on the next, theme. just your first, uh, and that the first agenda. Uh, yeah, I can see that. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, the next regular board meeting will be Saturday, October 16th, 2021, in the Fort Clark boardroom at 9 a.m. Uh, do we have any other announcements? Mm -hmm. okay. All right, we will now, uh, do we have a motion to adjourn the meeting? Motion to adjourn. Second. We'll adjourn the meeting at 1247. No, I'm sorry. Excuse me. Uh, all in favor? Sorry about that. We'll now adjourn the meeting at 1247. Thank you. Have a good week, Robert. Y'all too. Be careful. Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you, Robert. Thank you. Okie dokie. Have a good weekend, folks. You too. Enjoy the game. Yeah, we're only going to do it. Well, but is it, uh, did it make TV or just the. Nice and Texas. <laughs> and it would if I was in my house in Round Rock because I had a far more network. Well, San Antonio should. San Antonio probably found a channel for it. Yeah, not worth that much. <laughs> Okie dokie. Julia, are you going to take these documents? Yeah, I okay. can. I can take them. And then um, if Matt and his crew will take care of the permits. Okay. Yeah. We'll do that. Okay. Yeah, we have a good week. Yeah. Well, it's Tuesday. All right. <laughs> yeah. Yep. All right, guys. Take care. Thank you. All right. Oh. You stick around or you want these papers back here, Julie? When we get them for you? Um, I'll get them. I'll get them. Okay. I'll be here a little bit yet. All right. Take care of you, Julie. I, I, Thank you. I want to see how it works out loud on the response for the next couple of hours. Yeah. That might be interesting. See you later, guys. It will. I'll be checking it. <laughs> You know you're
your neighbor across the street is gone. The guy, the young guy is gone. So. Yeah, he has been restricted from the port. Okay, that's official? It's a, that part's official, yeah. Mr. Uh, Mr. Raymond, he's been busy cleaning up oh, wow. after him. Oh, yeah, I'll be here all week. Yeah, I wonder what he looks like inside now. I know, he had a lot of trash last week. So, he was very busy cleaning up. But, um, yeah, I haven't seen the kid in about two weeks I was very bothered. I, I was at home that Tuesday when the cops came over. Yeah. Uh, I was a little bothered about that incident because all the years that I lived there, because mm -hmm. you and I are neighbors, none of, yeah. nothing like that's ever happened. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Like Nathan that's had had words with him, too. And he told me about the dog. So, yeah, and... Uh, but it's been very quiet, right. very quiet right. over there. But there, I heard there's a warrant out, a couple right. warrants out for the kid too. But I think that should so, be stated. You know what? The second part is here, and can he come? Yeah, yeah. yeah but I mean, the sheriff has stacks of warrants, and he can't serve them the because he has no way to put them. Yeah, really. Yeah. It should be wow. Now, if I was a sheriff, I would pick him up, process him, let him out right. on PR bond, so depending on the on the charge. Right. You know? yeah, but yeah, um, the, just so that it goes to the process. That's what I mean. I don't know the totality of the legality of him being able to do that, but I think it's very dangerous because anyway, see you like when I was a probation officer, our number one mission see was ya. the protection of the community. Mm -hmm. Now, the federal system had a lot more authority compared to the state system. Right. You know, um, um, so that was the biggest frustration when I went back work for this, work, to work for the state mm -hmm. because if I signed off on a warrant and got the judge to sign it at 9 o'clock, 9.30 in the morning, right. by 4 or 5 o'clock in the afternoon, the marshals were knocking on the door yeah. or knocking the door down. Oh, wow. Yeah, there was no, ah, we'll see when he comes in. Oh, we'll call him in. Around here, if you have a warrant for your arrest, they'll call you in to come check in. We'll, you know. and, so, and people come in. <laughs> and people come in because yeah. the smart ones come in. The other ones take off or hide or whatever else. Right, know? right. So... That wow. Was, so anyway, that's just the way it is. <laughs> but the federal system is suffering right now for other reasons. Yeah, it is. Okay. Okay, take care. I have time to help you or help with that, to respond to that guy. Okay. Um, uh, hey, are you going to want me, uh, we're going to work it to where I'm going to learn everything, respond, and or have responded you and Peterson look at it, or what I would, is that the case? I would rather he do it. Um, well, he hasn't been responding at all. Okay. It's all been because none of it's been directed to him. It's been all directed to it's us. Yeah, and so Julie is helped by um, coordinating some of the documents, and then some of the documents have come from Gabby um, that we presented to him, um, which were redacted. So why don't Monday? I'll gather all of the documents that we have, just like Sandy did for me. And I, so I've got all the documents. We'll lay them out and just say, look, we'll, here's we'll everything. Something real yeah, quick. yeah, we can come up with something. And you know, I think really. My what, background tells me is the lack of response. Is like no, I, I mean, I, I don't, I don't disagree with you. But they boilerplated us right back when we responded to them. So, you know, it's like. They're creating this trail, but like when we ask you what you want and we tell you the fee, and then you don't say do it, you just send us the same thing. Like we're not going to give you a different response because you sent it again, right? Like does this person even live here? Or you have no idea. I don't think they live here. No, no, they do, no, they do not live here because it's a lot up scenario. It's a charter who wants to, who wants a lot. Mm -hmm. That's kind of like the scenario. Yeah, and they're bothered by. There was a loophole, and. Um, I if I recall the system, yeah. if, it if I was a charter, I'm going to lock up. Yeah. It would come and pick okay. up a lot. It's, There's not that many lots here. The board at one time changed the rules saying yeah. there has to be one available to give you. You might not like it. Yeah. 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 We're done. And then uh, they were, they were very strict about the six months start building. But, you know, I was of the opinion, you know, there's a lot of it. The, if, if Fort Clark had a lot, and we're not getting zero on it. And you want to buy it, you're, you're moving up. Travis Hewitt, Hewitt buys it, pays the assessment on it. I thought it was kind of harsh to to force that person to build something in six months and they were like teetering on it. Well, but you're paying, you're, we're already, we're already paying the assessment yes. on the other side. So. 
I mean, I, but and, we're dumping the charters. Yeah, but the thing, the the I think that there was a time period where there was some sort of loophole that they're looking for, and the loophole was closed under Sandy. And they 